In a hybrid work environment, unexpected chats take you away from the task that you're trying to focus on. When a chat isn't related to your task, it causes you to switch focus. It can be difficult to return to your task, forgetting what you've been working on, and when it happens multiple times throughout the day, it can leave you feeling like you haven't achieved much. Stay in the flow of work and use tasks to manage distractions. You can do this right within Teams. What I like to do is block out some time in my calendar to focus on documents. So if it was a task, then I'll drag that directly onto the calendar. And I like to open up a document within Microsoft Teams so that I can edit or review the document and I can also have conversations alongside it. I'll open up the conversations pane here too. So now I can have a conversation with Joni as I am reviewing the document with her. Alright, so I'm going to research this and I want to set a task there for myself. So I'll turn um, Joni's comment through to a task. So we'll turn that chat into a task and I'll just change up the uh, title here for just to make the task a bit easier to read. Okay, and I'll also just drop that into our project team um, and into the planner for that team. I'll just make sure, yes, it's in the change management bucket and we'll set the date there for Monday. Oh, I'll assign it to myself to begin with. And I will post a reply about this task in the conversation. All right, so there's a card there for the task and the details can be viewed by Johnny or, Johnny or myself. All right, well, there's a chat coming in here from Isaiah. Oh, yeah, so it's uh, something else I've got to work on with him. We've got some videos that need to be reviewing. So he's seen my status is busy. I am indeed busy. All right, so I'm going to turn his task or his chat into a task as well. And again, we'll just change up the title. All right, and we'll change that to important and we'll set the date to today. And add that as a task. Okay, and back to reviewing our document. All right, now I'm going to just set myself some time and do not disturb. So I'll just set the duration and we'll set to do not disturb. We'll make it for about an hour just to give me some time to focus on the reviewing of this document. And I'll also set a status note so people know what I'm working on. That might help them make a decision about whether they should leave me a message or wait till later. Okay, back to reviewing the document. Okay, so we've um, spent some time on the document and now I'm going back to my list of tasks. And we'll first of all just update the task in our team about researching. So that's a task assigned to me, it's in my team. Yes, I found that the date is in late September. Send that. And we'll just change the progress to completed. Okay, next task. That was my task of things to do. And that's right, I was going to get back to Isaiah. So I'll just open up the conversation. Okay. And we'll let him know that I can work now. Fantastic. Tasks are an essential tool for managing your distractions and tethering you to the task that you want to get completed.
Being able to create that task from the conversation means you can stay in the flow of work and return back to your focus quickly and calmly.